nervous, but you know, I, don't, I don't think we came out with the same confidence that we had had the past couple of weeks. I think that's the biggest thing. And uh, we did see a lot of lazy gas and things like that. And in the end, you know, this is something we never expected to be here. And uh, I, I can't take anything away from Sabbath. I mean, they absolutely helped physical us. I mean, they were, they were absolutely better than you know. And, they, they, they executed what they needed to do. They, they got the, the Kongs kid free. Um, you know, and, and the Wellington kid uh, used the baseline very effectively. So those are a couple of things that we made, that we absolutely talked about and didn't want to have happen. And, and that doesn't bode well for you. You don't do it. Kevin Perry on the bench for the third travel is so early. Yeah. I'm sure it took you out of a lot of things. Well, just having her leadership on the bench. It, it is. I mean, it's a hard, it's a hard thing. I mean, it's not only points, but I mean, it's the, the one aggressive ball handler that we really have. I mean, the Monica does a Monica does a great job, but you know, it, it's still not the aggressive ball handler. You know, she she'll get there. You know, starting a soft point. Uh, and without without Kerry, we didn't have a penetrator. You know, and you know that's that's not going to work if you just pass the perimeter. It just doesn't work against somebody as aggressive as they are. Um, you alluded to it earlier, but such a young team. I think you thought winning the Central Mass Championship was, you know, quite an accomplishment. It is. For this group. It, it's, uh, it is. I, you know, um, I, I can remember at the beginning of the year, I actually got asked, you know, how many wins do you really think you're going to have? And I, I'd be lying if I said any more than eight. And I said, but, you know, I really, for the two seniors, I'd love to have ten so they could at least play in the tournament. So the fact that somehow uh, the two of them and, and those little kids found a way to pull it together and get 20 wins is, is actually amazing. You know, and we told them, you know what, you'll be disappointed today, but like everybody else, eventually you're going to realize that you accomplished a heck of a lot and you get some unbelievable memories that you'll be able to share with each other forever. So that's what we're looking at right now. Thanks. John, talk about uh, coming back, uh, having this little run with Kerry in the past couple of years and being able to coach her and, and have this success like that. Well, you know, it, it's a, it was a, honestly a dream come true. Never thought it was going to happen. Uh, you know, she worked so hard, and the fact that uh, you know, I coached her, you know, starting a travel league in second grade, so it will be, uh, it will be very different. You know, going to practice next year, and, and yes, I do totally intend on coaching Sutton High School next year. I, I know I get that question asked a lot. Um, but you know, she just she just brings so much leadership, and, and not only in games, but practice. She goes to every day with a smile, and you know, she's been. She just I said it at the beginning. You know, she's just such a mother hen. The little kids just love her. You know, the younger kids. I mean, they, they look up to her, and uh, even the JV team. You know, she comes in and they get all smiles. And, um, just just a, a wonderful couple of years. And, um, I'm gonna miss her a lot.